Top Golf is officially open in Canton. People there in the area are bracing for an increase in traffic. And it's not just because of the popular sports and entertainment venue. Jordan is back to explain. Jordan. Kate Liam, if you do visit Top Golf, you'll notice a lot of construction still being done there on Dedham Street, and it's work that residents of the area have been dealing with now for years. But it actually all started after the Route 128 station in Westwood was built. Now the concern is that with more people, those traffic headaches in that spot could get worse. To answer your question, it's been a headache. For commuters in Canton, it's been a journey watching improvements come to the Dedham Street overpass. Originally set to be completed in 2022, the project is still ongoing. And now, with the opening of Top Golf, traffic in the area is only expected to increase. There's an off ramp coming, and that's what that's going to be done hopefully within the year. The work including bridge reconstruction, off-ramp construction, and on-ramp upgrades. Canton Select Board Vice Chair John Connolly tells WBZ the new off-ramp will be pivotal in reducing area backups. The ramp is the key because that's going to take a lot of traffic off of like uh, Washington Street, Dedham Street. The state-funded project originally began after the opening of Westwood Station. Top Golf came into the mix after the fact, and the pandemic pushed it all behind. Connolly has been the board's liaison to the venue and says the business's busy times shouldn't add to rush hour traffic. 10 to 2, then it slows down, then from like 6 to nighttime. So that's a positive for us. Top Golf paying to install these traffic lights at the intersection where the facility meets the overpass. It's going to go from two lanes to four lanes plus. And if you notice, there's one, two, three, four sets of lights, which, it, which will help the traffic. Connolly says despite the already visible improvements, there is still concern within the community with Dedham Street already such a busy area. But with the revenue Top Golf is bringing in, for the most part, the town's excited. It's uh, 400 jobs full and part time, a lot of tax dollars for the people of the town, for our schools, our public works, our uh, first responders. So it's a it's a hole in one for us. By the way, Connolly adds that this is upping tax dollars from 100,000 to a million. If there are any headaches or big bumps along the road, the facility would be responsible for paying for any traffic details, for example, to help, not the town. Jordan Jagelinzer, WBZ News.